Hi loves, welcome to my channel, this mama loves Disney. Okay, so I'm here today with the uh, AliExpress haul. And um, so a bunch of my orders have been trickling in, you guys. I'm telling you, it's so dangerous when I'm actually getting my orders because it makes me want to order more. But um, so the first one I want to share is this die. It's a candy bar die. I didn't take it out of the bag because there's so many pieces. But um, honestly, I, I kept putting it in my cart, taking it out of my cart, putting it in my cart, taking it out. Was going to order it on Amazon, changed my mind. So I finally got it from Allie. I thought it was bigger. And come to find out, it is four inches by two inches. So it's really not that big. Um, but I had seen Armin, who is Happy Mail Queen. Hey, girl. And uh, I saw a darling, the darling little boxes that she made. So I went ahead and bit the bullet and went ahead and ordered this. So I'm looking forward to making some of those cute little boxes. Then I ordered this die that is a shaker and it is um, a guitar. So it's electric guitar. I had to get that. Um, cause I have, uh, family members who actually play electric guitar. So I just needed to get that one. Then I ended up getting a puppy dog, um, a German shepherd, um, die. You can see that. And he's got a little Santa hat and I did cut one out and realizing a piece did not all come all the way out. So I will put it on here so you can see what it looks like. I think it'd be really cute if it's cut out where you have the red for the Santa hat and then the little pom-pom, put a little pom-pom right there for the, the little ball at the end of his um, cap. And so this would look probably really good if it is d uh, done with black as well and you can double it up so it's black and tan. So I got that one. Then I got this shaker that is a puppy dog tag. So how cute is that? So it's a shaker, a puppy dog shaker. Um, sorry, a bone shaker. Sorry, I just dropped one. Sorry. Okay, so then I got this little witch. That is adorable. I'm going to be using... I've already cut out some of these little witches, so I'm going to be sharing that in a project soon. And then I got this little Minnie Mouse witch that is just absolutely adorable. And Josephine had made one of the cakes that I always share that Lisa, my friend, had, had gifted me. Hey, ladies. And so she had made the cake with these beautiful little uh, different designed candles. And I was like, oh my gosh, that is so cute. So I wanted to do the same. Then I have a poison apple that is perfect for Halloween projects. I got this, um, I don't know, um, little stitched um, circles. It's a nesting die of four circles that have hearts and exits. So it's like there's hearts that almost look like the O's and then you have the X's. So it's like hugs and kisses with love, lots of love. And so I thought those were darling. So I got that. And then I got a set of one, two, three, four, five, six nesting dies that have Mickey Mouse heads. And then I picked up this little Mickey Mouse cupcake die. And this is what this ends up looking like right there. Already done. And what I ended up doing with this is I just put a, a little bit of foam on the back so that it would just highlight it a little bit. So that is the Mickey Mouse die. Okay, so those are all the dies that I ended up picking up. And I also was going to share with you um, a bunch of free free dies that they sent me. That was so sweet. So I got this one and it says Miss You. And they actually literally sent me two of them. So I have one to gift. Then I got this one and it says, May Your Christmas Sparkle. And um, I may gift that one as well because I do have that one in my stash already. 
And then I have this one that's really cute. Um, I'm not sure, this kind of look reminds me of an ornament shape. And then it has a cute little fox. And my grandson, one of my grand, my youngest grandson, absolutely loves foxes. He's He wants one so bad. And I tell you, if they didn't go potty all over the house, I probably would get one. And then there's a little purse. And this is also one that I may gift that I was a free one too because I do have this one. Isn't that funny how I have these ones already? But um, it just makes it nice because then I can spread the love. Okay, then um, I had bought this on Amazon a long time ago. It's a Victor um, very easy to read roller because it has all the measurements. So it just makes it really easy. And I saw on Allie... And you, this has a film on it. It says they put a little note to remove, remove the film, which I haven't did yet because it just opened this. But um, it has exactly the same measurements on there. So I thought, you know what? This would be great to keep in my kitchen because I'm always needing a ruler in my kitchen. I always tend to pull out um, the measuring tape, but I don't know. It's kind of hard to keep it uh, out when you're just trying to measure something really quick. Um, so this is just so much easier so I can keep it in my drawer. Um, I got some jewelry. I ended up getting this little paw print. I thought it was really, really super cute. Can you see that? And then with the paw print, I ended up getting some of these really cute little earrings with a little paw print right there. I don't know if you can see that. So, oh, it's too hard to see. So yeah, so little paw print earrings. And then I ended up getting these little bat earrings. Um, I did get two sets. I got them in the black and I got them in the gold. Because you know Halloween's like right around the corner. And then I got some earrings that say D. Because most of my family and my closest friends call me D all the time. So I got some earrings. And then I had got a ring that says Dina. I also got another ring that says Richard and Dina. You guys, I love this. I've been getting all, and I got a bracelet that says Richard and Dina. I just, I love it. And then I also got another bracelet that says Texas with the heart, because I love Texas. And then I got another bangle that says Richard and Dina. It's kind of big, but it's okay. And then I ended up getting a new uh, watch band for Halloween. So I got... Um, so here's my watch band now, and so I got an uh, orange one, and then I got the black with the bling on it so that I could uh, use it for Halloween. And then I end up having a zero that is from uh, Nightmare Before Christmas that goes into these little holes, so I have a little zero to wear with that, okay, that I purchased a long time ago. Okay, and then I ended up picking up some of these little sprinkles. I actually thought they were going to be darker, but it's okay because I recently just hauled a video, some stuff, and I haven't shared that video yet, but the sprinkles that I did get, let me see if I can see them right now. The sprinkles that I did get are really super dark. I can't find them. Sorry. So this is great that these came in more pastel colors. And then I ended up getting these sprinkles. I don't know if you guys can see them, but they're little Minnie Mouse heads. Just super de duper cute for embellishing. Sorry about that. I just figured let me go ahead and clean these up because I will they might end up on the floor. And then I just figured I would share this. Um, this is my husband. I ordered me and my or my husband and I, I ordered uh, each um, a new phone case because both of us, within within a week of each other, I believe, we both broke our screens. And I had bought a new uh, case that had uh, uh, Bambi on it and Thumper. And it's it's really thin and it it doesn't have um, a, like a beveled edge that stands up. So the, it's really easy for it to just, you put it down and it can break. So both of our screens got broken, which we had protective covers, but still the glass had broken. So I had ordered him and I new phone cases and mine happens to be a rose gold. And then I ordered his in black. And I tell you guys, these are awesome. 
So I just thought I'd share that. Then I had ordered some tassels. They had a tassel mix. Um, I thought there was going to be a little bit more colors, but it's okay. There's predominantly mostly purple, which purple is um, one of my absolute favorite colors. So that works really well. I love the pinks. And, um, and then I also love this um, ivory color too. And then of course these other colors. But so this ended up being a perfect mix for me. I love the greens too. So that was great. And then I ended up getting these glow in the dark Mickey heads. And what I love about these beads, they're little um, rubber beads. And what I loved about them is the hole is actually on the side because most of the beads that I have that are Mickey heads, the holes are on the, sorry, I, on the top. I'm sorry. Uh, most of them are on the side of the ones that I have. So I just have a scribe pen and you just fit it right on here and then it just fits right there on the top. And how cute is that? So you can use it as, you can add dingles or, you know, you can add bracelets or, or necklaces or whatever because um, it's on the top. So I just thought that was really cool and I wanted to share that. And they come in all kinds of different colors. And I think um, these are pink, but when you're in the dark, they glow, gosh, I think they glowed purple. I have to double check. Don't quote me on that because I could be wrong, but I think they glow purple. So that is my AliExpress 